Alexa, lights on. What can I say? This is 2020, baby. No, you want to know what 2020 is? 2020 is me working till 1.30 in the morning last night slash this morning. Hashtag bartender life. Getting out, eating, showering, and then making the coffee for this video at 4 in the morning. Going to sleep at like 6 in the morning, having a haircut at 11 in the morning, running 10 minutes late, and missing your haircut. I put on this fuzzy sweater as a tribute to Emma Chamberlain, even though she doesn't really wear those anymore. But anyway, ignore how I look, okay? That's not why we're here. I'm not a heartthrob boy. I am just a boy. You saw the title of this video. I'm reviewing Emma Chamberlain's coffee brand, Chamberlain Coffee. I'm gonna pretty much cut to the chase quickly and do that first, and then once I have the coffee, I'm gonna talk to you guys for all of you who are already subscribed to me and are here for me. I think the background looks pretty much good. If there's anything back there that should not be in this video, ignore it. You don't see it. This is my room, not yours. Ignore it. Oh, also, imagine that I'm in jeans right now. Now, I know I'm kind of late to the game. I saw quite a few people do this video already, but none of them did it exactly, like, following her recipe. If I was Emma and I saw people, like, fucking it up and then reviewing it and saying, like, mm, it's okay, I'd be pissed. So, I'm gonna follow it exactly, exactly like, she, like did she did it. In her video, she used the Nut Pods Original Creamer, and then she used the Vanilla Almond Milk sweetener uh almond milk it's almond milk that's what it is and then the cold brew in a mason jar i actually always drink my iced coffee out of a mason jar when i drink it from home you guys saw how she made this so i'm not gonna put that part in this video basically you fill this with 600 milliliters of water you put three bags in the water and you cover it leave it overnight i saw people complaining about the price of this it's like basically two dollars a bag but it is biodegradable i don't know really what that means drag me i don't care does that mean i could like throw this out the window and it will grow a plant i don't know but the reason why you use like three in the cold brew is number one because this is more than one cup of coffee like this will last you number two when you're doing cold brew or iced coffee it mixes with the ice so it gets watery which means when you brew iced coffee you need to brew it twice as strong because it's gonna mix with ice when you do the hot coffee I think it's only like one um bag but I don't drink hot coffee so I think in the video she pours it into a smaller mason jar and makes it in this also oh my god wait 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 whoa 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 Whoa. I know a lot of you guys see me drinking Dunkin' Donuts and Starbucks. However, let me explain. Because I know you guys are going to be like, oh, I'm not even going to fucking listen to somebody who drinks Starbucks and Dunkin' Donuts. Okay, number one, go fuck yourself. Number two, I know good coffee. Let me explain. I'm a drug addict, okay? Caffeine is a drug. I am addicted to it. I'm a drug addict for caffeine, okay? I'm going to get my supply wherever I can. Dunkin' Donuts, Starbucks. I know Starbucks tastes like battery acid, as Emma Chamberlain once said. I know it sucks, okay? I'm addicted. Number two is I know no good coffee because my brother, who is way more aesthetically pleasing than I am, um, he is like a coffee expert fanatic, like orders like the best coffee offline, like French presses, makes his coffee from home, goes to like cute little cafes for his coffee. I can't be bothered. Put a seat for me. I'm also poor. No, you don't get a seat. So I have his coffee sometimes. I know good coffee. I'm just a caffeine addict. Which brings me to my next point. Everyone's like, oh, I'm a coffee expert. Like, I drink it every day. I'm an addict. Oh my god. Yeah, we all do, okay? We all drink coffee every day. You're not special. You're not an expert, okay? Relax. Ugh. Everyone thinks there's something special because they drink coffee every day. Newsflash! We all do. And I just want to say that oh, this boy. was completely unintentional. Literally, he's wearing a coffee yeah, shirt. Yeah, it's very unintentional. He's got to go work out, so... Yeah, it's okay. taking way too long. Shut up. He's going to go work out, so I want, like, the real coffee expert to try it, give you his opinion, and then I'll... So before that, though, I like dark roast coffee. This is a medium roast. Okay. Listen, I'm not an expert. I just like coffee. Really? But I do not like Starbucks. I will not get Starbucks. I'm not a Starbucks fan. Again, I'm not really a fan of Starbucks. I actually made a whole video dragging Starbucks. It's easily accessible. I want you to try it first. Oh. Joe, just I, I just washed my hands. I just washed my hands. That's disgusting. I like. I'm. I'm that's all I'm gonna be tasting. No, it's not, Joe. Come on. Get real. <laughs> what do I do? Critical thinking. I don't do that. In the video, she fills it to... there. Okay. Wait, whoa, whoa, whoa. He doesn't want to be called an expert, but, like, he does get his coffee offline, like, more expensive coffee, French press, all that. I'm just more of, like, an average, so you'll get both of our opinions. Go. It actually has good flavor. Really? Oh my god, I, I'm rooting for Emma. I really am. And he's brutally honest, does not give a fuck about social media. I do like the flavor. Really? Mm -hmm. I came down here guns blazing. I don't know this Emma chick, and... You never heard of her? No. It has good flavor. Since I started drinking this cold brew, I... 
Now, I love Emma Chamberlain. She's one of my favorite YouTubers. I don't care what you want to say about her. She never puts any negativity on the internet. She's very fun. I always wondered what the coffee she's drinking tastes like. I'm excited to try an Emma Chamberlain approved coffee. Wow. When she said it tasted nutty in my head, I was like, I wish I knew what a nutty coffee tasted like. I don't know what the fuck that means. I get it now. This does have a very nutty taste. You have the approval from the average coffee drinker who will drink coffee out of a puddle on a sidewalk in Manhattan. And then you have an expert who only drinks the highest class coffee. Give your full thoughts of this before you are dismissed. Okay. I like the, the black, the black coffee. It was good for, uh, it was, it was a medium roast. All right. What do you want me to say? It's just like, it's a YouTube Like, you gotta... All right, guys! The coffee was really good. I really enjoyed it. Okay, good. All okay. right. Okay? Yeah. Shh. That's... Yep. Yeah. So there you have it from him. I really like it. I would definitely order it again. And yes, it is $10 for five, but that's cheaper than you would pay at a normal coffee shop or Starbucks or anywhere you go. Are you gonna say bye? Joey Jabroni on Twitch. He's like crazy good at video games. He twitches pretty often. I usually jump on the stream with him. So kind of like a join channel. He just like makes some money from it. So whatever. Go subscribe to him on Twitch. Bye. This is genuinely really good. You could tell it's a really good quality of coffee. Totally get what she meant when she said it tastes nutty. I'm used to having nuts in my mouth. I am a fan. Emma, if you're watching this, I think you did an amazing job. I think you're doing an amazing job. Although I do love Emma, I wanted to keep my opinion very real and I, I love it. My brother, who I thought he was gonna say bad things, he really liked it, which I'm so happy about because he is such a hard person to please. So good job, Emma, you did it. I'll put a link for her coffee in the description as well if you guys wanna try it. Happy 2020, everybody. Before and after my last video, I was just like chilling but i am back in action now i have my coffee to edit this video with i am all set let's make this year better than last year i think that's it bye